computer. Okay, hey, we're recording. Perfect. Uh, hi, everybody. Thank you very much for being here. I really appreciate you taking the time to join us on the March 17th uh, monthly uh, Expert Connect uh, for Living Healthy List. Uh, this is a great opportunity for, uh, for experts to get to know one another, um, really get to connect with one another, and to you know, ask questions, you know, what are we doing at uh, Living Healthy List? What's happening here in the, in the, you know, the home office, the home office? Um, and uh, what's coming you know, down the pipeline? Uh, so for those of you who are not here live, please uh, do, take a, do take some time and uh, listen into the replay. Uh, I wanted to make this another quick one, uh, or as quick as we can, um, uh, to, because everybody's kind of got a lot going on with uh, being home with the coronavirus. Um, so we don't have anyone scheduled today to do their 10 minute presentation. Uh, I promise starting uh, in April, we'll get back on track with that. Um, and I think that is, uh, that's important. Uh, also, another thing that we could do with those 10 minute presentations, uh, for those of you who, uh, who are on pretty regularly, and have done your presentation, we can take that time to make it uh, kind of like a, a 10 minute uh, educational piece. So if there are topics that you would like for us to touch on, I mean, each of us is an expert in their area. Um, so I think if we all had a chance to um, teach in, you know, not, it's not about, you know, who we are and what we do, but what's the 10 in 10 minutes, like what's something that we can use and take away from uh, our time here together. Uh, so I'd like to, uh, for those of you who don't know me, of course you should all know me. <laughs> I'm Denise Siegel. I'm the uh, CEO and curator of Living Healthy List. And um, I would like everyone to take a couple minutes just to tell us uh, a little bit about who you are, where you, where you are, and a little bit about yourself. Uh, I will ask you kind of just based on where everybody is on my screen. I have a little cardinal that keeps flying at my window. <laughs> so if I look distracted, it's because he's like trying to get in my house. <laughs> so uh, Lisa, would you start for us, please? Yes. Um, I don't know the meanings of cardinals, but I know there is one. <laughs> um, hi, my name is Lisa Medley, and I am uh, sitting in my son's bedroom. Um, who has a desk. <laughs> he's 11, so he's taken over the first floor. My husband's home, working from home. I'm so grateful that, like, working from home and, like, set up and that my husband has a job that he can still get paid even though he's working from home. Like, just so many things to be grateful for. Um, so, yeah, that's just very top of mind. And hence, you know, like, the very outdated train... <laughs> Um, for those of you that didn't see, um, this is this is one of the mascots, the Mosasaurus here, you know, anything to give a smile, right? Which is kind of what I'm about. Um, my, my business is Solistic Arts, S-O-U-L, Solistic Arts, and really offering a lot of different ways to just connect with your soul, yourself, your best self, um, and I use a very body-centered um, approach to that, and really help people transform their body mindset and remember what their body really is and how divine it is and how sacred it is and how it can be supportive to connect and express and literally embody um, the being of light that you are. And I'm happy to be part of this group and evolve with it and happy to be here. Thanks, Lisa. Oh, it's great to have you. Uh, Ms. Luann, if you would follow. Hi everyone, I'm Luann Beekler. I go by Luann B and I am in Rochester, Minnesota. Well, not really, I'm in a little town outside Rochester, <laughs> Byron, but I'm pretty close to Denise. And um, I'm a business lifestyle coach and I help people to identify their passions for their work and set a course for living that in their life and use that within your business as your authentic branding model for who you are and sharing with the world what it is that you want to contribute in the world. And that's what attracts people to you is the authentic you, right? And um, what else? What else was I supposed to say? Oh, and I'm the I hug lady. And if I want to spread anything right now, it's virtual hugs. People are hurting, people are afraid, people are scared. And 
Um, I did a little video recently, it's out there on Facebook, about hugging without touching, keeping your social distance, and we can still do that and share it with the world. Spread the message, that would be the best thing. It would make my heart sing to know that that was out there and people were using it. Somebody said some nasty words to me about it last night, and I'm like, people are scared when they're going to come back at you about that, you know? Yeah. So I think that just encourages me to share it more um, in the world. And with support of people like you, I, I'm here today because I'm like, so much is swirling around. I need my like-minded, awesome people to <laughs> be uplifted. So wanted to be here with all of you today for that purpose. And uh, with your help, I'm going to go online more and do a little more Facebook Live. A friend of mine said to me yesterday, Luann, you'd be surprised at how much, how good it feels to see your little clips and, and uplift people throughout the day. So I think that's what we need more of. And thank goodness we have tools like Facebook that just pour those messages out to the world and try and uplift the energy. Yep. Thank you. So thanks for all you do to do your part in that, because I know you all do. Awesome. Thanks, Samantha. Miss Lori. <clears throat> Hi, everybody. I'm Lori from... Lori Brown Woolridge from Virginia. Um, I'm sorry, I've been kind of MIA. My dad fell and broke his hip and had surgery, and so I've been dealing with all that. Then I got sick, and um, now, you know, I'm stuck at home with everybody else. <laughs> so <that's all laughs> good. Um, by the way, red cardinals are a sign that angels are near, and you should also. Um, listen to your inner voice. So when you see a lot of red cardinals, that means that too. Um, so I um, have my coaching group is called the Soul Innovations Coaching. I specialize in confidence building and spiritual creative and uh, relationships. I, my signature program is called Soul Sexy Transformation, which is next level coaching designed to help women master the mind, body, and soul integration um, and thrive in their love and relationship lives. So I build myself as a love connoisseur and I do a lot of coaching, helping people understand love and how it operates in so many different levels so that they recognize the fact that they are yet surrounded by love in ways and in places they don't even realize because a lot of people think because they don't have that one romantic relationship, that somehow they are lacking in love. So uh, that's what I do. Um, I'm tr working really hard to take myself to the next level in just terms of social media and uh, exposure. I'm a background kind of girl. And the whole idea of putting myself out on more, I know people it's like faking their, you know, I can <laughs> see public, I can do, I have no issues, stuff like that, TV, but when it comes to social media, I don't know what it is about it. I, um, I just am not good at it yet. But damn it, by the time I'm 75, I'm going to be kidding. <laughs> <laughs> So, Giving yourself um, a couple of years there, huh? <laughs> <laughs> um, the, and the last thing I want to say is that um, Suzanne and Denise, I am a little behind the eight ball with my class. I know because I had the whole. You had a lot going on. Yeah, but I, I'm, I'm, I, I know you want to launch in April. I'm going to be there, so we'll talk after that. Okay, we'll we'll chat about that in a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Thanks, Lori. Hey, Michelle. Good morning, beautiful ladies. Such an honor to be here with you today. And I am Irish, so I'm wearing my green, looking forward to my corned beef and cabbage. And I have not only my kids home from school for the next month, but my husband's home unpaid. So I'm so grateful for an online um, business. And I'm a personal finance coach and educator here in the San Francisco Bay Area, a holistic and visionary. So a little different than your typical financial person. I work with uh, women in both private one-on-one -on -one capacity as well as groups and wanted to add or share that I just added a teen online uh, live six-week 
virtual course. Oh. So very, yes, very exciting. There's a demand and with kids now sitting at home with no activities, no sports, no school. Uh, I figured this was a really great opportunity to launch this and it's, you know, April is financial literacy month. So I, I will share uh, the event and the, the links and everything in our expert Facebook group. Um, but just a great you know resource to share for parents with teens who would like them to do something productive with their time over the next month or or who knows i mean there's been rumors that our our classes are going to be canceled through summer yeah so awesome looking forward to that yeah definitely send us the links and um you know we'll get that out um everywhere we can you know between the event page and actually luann i have a bunch of stuff from uh of yours that you know upcoming in the fall and the the late summer and the fall that I need to get up. Um, everybody moved around. Uh, Suzanne, <laughs> like, where did everybody go? <laughs> Good morning, everyone. I am um, navigating the waters of having my son home and my husband works from home. So we are, yeah, we're, we're navigating it. It's day two, it feels better than yesterday, so. We've made some steps in the right direction, um, staying on a schedule. Um, who I am, I, I would consider myself a life and business coach for entrepreneurs. And I've recently taken my business from uh, basically working with people one-on-one -on -one and moving all of those one-on-one -on -one people, still giving them one-on-one -on -one time, but moving them into a mastermind group that meets once or twice a month. And it's been amazing and it's been gratifying and uh, requests for more requests for from my network marketing people to do a network marketing mastermind, which is in the works. And I'm excited that I held back my life coaching program I was going to launch in February um, because I decided to invite some experts in and that will now launch in June um, and I'm super excited because I think people will feel by then they're ready to jump back on um, getting their life back to normal so um, supporting my community uh, within the next couple of weeks, doing lots of co-working events, um, you know, two hour spaces of time where I was going to be traveling to a corporate training or traveling to a client that I now have open in my schedule and I'm giving it to either existing clients or my community. Uh, so anybody wants invites to that, just let me know and I'll send you the Zoom invite. Um, I have one today from three to five that I'm going to teach how to find your ideal clients online mm -hmm. using all my secret detective tactics. So I love doing that. So I figured, you know what, why not just offer it out there? Yeah. So, so if you wouldn't mind putting the link in the, the chat. Yeah. Because yeah. Uh, for some reason I, I missed that one. I, uh, there's one tonight also you have. Uh, yes, that's a, Tonight is a free class, a master class, which I'm using to build my list for my life coaching program that's coming up. And it's all about using positive psychology to rewrite those negative stories in your head. So it would probably be more powerful for all of your clients rather than you guys. Um, but it's still really fun because it helps you rewrite so many different stories that we have so when you sit down to write stuff for your ideal client it's helpful too and if i have to say that i'm taking three clients through this book right now um called building your story brand um and basically uh, denise is such a good listener uh so this book is blowing these three people's minds mm -hmm. they are like i had no idea it was that easy to build the language for my ideal client i had no idea that i had all of that inside of me and the best part when you buy the book which is the three thousand dollar course you buy the book he gives you the worksheets to download and print so you can not only do 
you could do a worksheet for your ideal client. You could do one for your second ideal client. You could do a, a worksheet for a program and yeah. you have all the language for your sales page. It's literally, my clients are freaking out over yeah. it. It's been amazing. So I had to share that with you guys today, those ninja tricks to get closer to your ideal client language and speaking to them, especially now we have a little bit of extra time. So mm -hmm. true. Awesome. Yeah. Thanks, Suze. Welcome. Hey, Lauren. You found us. <laughs> Sorry about that. Yay. There was something wonky with, with, with uh, Zoom. I don't know if it was something I did or if they were just, they're kind of uh, a little overwhelmed. Well, I just, I can never find where I'm supposed to find the link. Like, even when I type it in, like, and I say, okay, go look on the Facebook page, but it's not the Facebook page. It's the Facebook It's the Messenger. expert. It's, yeah, no, no, no. Well, I, put it, I put it up on Messenger, at, like, at 1020. Yeah. yeah, which didn't come through to uh, like We're going to get better at sending and, and having these things posted ahead of time. Um, the, uh, I'm going to introduce uh, somebody very special uh, to me uh, who is on the call. We can't see her beautiful face, but um, Debbie's going to be helping me uh, get that stuff kind of ironed out. So it's not me at 20, 20 minutes before going, oh, shoot, I forgot about the link. Because usually that's usually what happens. You know, Denise, if, if you work it out and I can do it, you'll know that you're good. <laughs> cool. If I can find it. <laughs> I, I hate Facebook. I came late to the party on Facebook, people. I am so sorry. I, I didn't join till like a couple years ago. <laughs> my business is less than a couple years old. And I like my whole interaction, it's just vis visually assaultive to me. Like I feel pained when I look at it. So, you know, like finding the right spots and there, there's so many places to check and I just can never find the right thing. So I, yeah, by some combination of me having many mistakes, I finally found you. Cool. <laughs> Hi, you. happy to be here with everybody today. Yes, the social interaction is dwindling. So virtual interaction is where it's all at. I'm sure you guys already covered that. Um, yeah, it's a little strange. I mean, I have my daughter home from North Carolina where they have not actually canceled her school. They are welcoming kids to come back to campus, uh, whether they want to come now, which is at their spring, during their spring break, or April 6th. Um, they're asking if people tra travel to stay home until April 6th, wow. but they're still saying they can come back. Their classes are online, but they're happy to have them back at school. So I don't, I don't know. Maybe it's better, safer to send her back. We're like kind of going around about that in circles. Yeah. Nice to have her home and very distracting, you know, when you get these little ducklings to come back into the nest for a little while. All I really want to do is hang out with her. So, yeah. <laughs> um, but I'm happy to be here with you guys. Um, so I am Lauren Weinberg and my uh, business is Lasting Change Wellness. And I help people find lasting change in so many different ways, but I specialize in helping people avoid or if need be recover from burnout i'm a psychologist and family therapist by trade so i think that that makes me kind of uniquely qualified to deal with people who have maybe crossed over into the dark side of that equation mm -hmm. um, uh, but um, i love to speak I, I speak out all the time and that's not happening now so you know that makes it a little more challenging that is usually how i get my clients um, but, and I haven't, if anybody, I mean, I haven't figured out maybe the technique, I'd love to hear from people, uh, Suzanne, maybe you have some thoughts on this, that if you are doing virtual speaking, like I spoke for a networking group the other night, but it's, you know, I'm not like capturing people's email the same way as passing mm. the board would, or, how, you know, like even putting out what I do and saying, do you want to, you know, yeah. that free time, like, it's just a little bit harder. It's not coming as naturally. Um, so I could use any tips where that's concerned. Yeah. Um, but that's what I do. I hope people, you know, keep the plate spinning. Awesome. Thanks, Lauren. So we have one other person uh, on with us today, and I'd like to introduce uh, Dee Cassidy, Debbie Cassidy. Debbie is uh, here in Minnesota also. She is actually one town over um, from me, a town called Orinoco. And Debbie is our new virtual assistant. Uh, the coolest thing about having Debbie as a virtual assistant is sometimes she's not virtual. Sometimes we actually meet face to face. <laughs> so it's really great. Uh, I'm, I'm really excited to have Debbie on board. Uh, Debbie, if you can just give us a sh little shout out. You're muted. 
but I mean, I know she's got two kids, kiddos at home. There she is. Are you there, Deb? Okay, I remuted her. Well, Debbie is out. She'll, I'm sure she'll pop back on. Uh, she is our new virtual assistant. I'm really excited. Um, we had a meeting on Monday, ironed a couple things out. Um, she doesn't uh, have a microphone. What's that? She just text, ch chatted that she doesn't have a microphone to talk to you. Aha, that'll do it. Okay, well, next time. <laughs> So thanks everybody for, for joining in. It's always really great to, uh, especially the, you know, this time, everybody is kind of feeling so stuck at, you know, we're stuck at home and we have a lot of things that we can do for our businesses, but I don't know about you guys, but I know sometimes I, I just, the, the motivation sometimes is a little hard. Um, and so I think, you know, just by being able to connect with one another, uh, whether here on Zoom or um, offline, I think it's really um, a great opportunity for all of us. Um, so uh, Debbie just said, welcome. Uh, oh no, Michelle just said that to Debbie. <laughs> Hi Debbie. <laughs> um, I just wanted to take uh, a little bit of time to go through a couple things that we have, um, coming down the pipeline, uh, with living healthy list. Um, uh, Lori mentioned earlier, the, um, the programs that we're looking to, um, put together. And this is something called living healthy list Academy. Um, Living Healthy List Academy, the point of, or the reason for Living Healthy List Academy is kind of that next touch point for our audience. You know, we are growing an audience. People are popping onto Living Healthy List. You know, we really need to, in this year, really need to expand and, and find um, and, and have our audience find us. Um, and so people are looking on the website. They could look at our expert profiles. They can read our blogs. But they're not maybe maybe they're not quite ready to pick up the phone and talk to somebody one on one. But maybe there's um, they see on Living Healthy List Academy there's a program by Suzanne and it's an entry level program. I kind of call it um, Living Healthy List 101. So kind of like freshman English type of thing. So it's an entry level um, evergreen type of program that you have um, that we're gonna that we'll put up on Living Healthy List uh, Teachable site. So that's, the Teachable site is Living Healthy List Academy. Um, so we'll have a whole different, uh, you know, different um, programs in different categories. Obviously our categories, health, wellness, personal development are fun. Um, and so there'll be something in there for everyone. And because they're uh, the 101 uh, courses, they're, they're meant to be $199 or less. Um, more than likely, a lot of them will be, like I know I have a program that, that's on there, I think it's $97, it may actually be $47. Um, and it's a way for people to start understanding better who we are. I think it's another uh, value added piece to Living Healthy List. Now, with the Teachable um, site, the cool thing is, when you have a program up on Living Healthy List Academy, and Suzanne is actually um, helping us out with this because um, uh, we wanna make sure that all of the programs look the same, uh, have the logo, so it, it, it looks pretty consistent throughout. Obviously, it's your, it would be your program, so it would have your, your taste and your flair, but it still needs to, um, to have the Health, Living Healthy List logo uh, so people know where they're finding it. Um, and then what we'll do, and I haven't figured this out yet. I haven't really talked to you guys enough about this. You know, what is the, what is the percentage? You know, we, will, we would split the cost. You know, we'd split, so say it's $100, uh, a $100 course. You know, what would we, how would we split um, uh, the fee, you know, between Living Healthy List and the expert? So we'll, we'll, we'll talk about that a little bit more down the road. Lori, I think we're going to push back to uh, launching in June. Um, mostly because, uh, the summit series is going to run in April. And so it just didn't make sense to do two things at once. And we're really not on board, um, to, to launch at the end of April anyway. Um, so, uh, let's, I'm hoping by the middle of June, we can do that. Um, questions about what we're thinking about living healthy list Academy. Go ahead, Lauren. Do you have uh, an idea of like, 
the amount of content you want or the, I know you're saying that it's beginner, but are you saying like make it a minimum of this duration or, um, you know, like a certain kind of standardization for what it is that you're looking for? So the program that I have on there now is a six week program and it's a do it yourself um, type of program. It's a, it's a, um, what it was they called? It's called reconnect to your health. And it's, it's um, a menu log. It's a menu. It's a food log. It's um, recipes and it's step-by-step step. each week. This is what you do each week. Um, and initially I ran that as a live program. You know, every week we got, we connected uh, on Zoom. Um, and that's still a great way to do that. But this actually is easier for a lot of people. So I think, you know, six weeks, eight weeks is probably plenty. Uh, probably don't want to go any longer because at that point, then we want this to be introductory. So I think six to eight weeks is plenty. I would say probably six weeks is makes, makes sense because at that point, you know, you, we want people to start, we want them to go to that next level and say, you know, I did this program. I want to connect with, you know, I want to connect with Lauren and that, you know, you don't want to wait 12 weeks for them to, to connect. So. But you're not looking for like a one time, like here's a one day learning opportunity or are you? Could it be? Why not? I don't know. I'm, that's why I'm asking. Yeah, why not? <laughs> I, I think, you know, right now, I think we, it's, you know, the nice thing about what we're doing is this is the first time we're doing this. And so, you know, at, collectively as a group, um, you know, we make decisions. I mean, obviously there are some decisions that Living Healthy List needs to make, but these are decisions that I love to make with the experts. I mean, you know, you guys are my sounding board. You're my, um, you're my experts. You're my, um, the people that I trust. So, you know, a lot of things like this, we'll kind of figure out as we go. Okay. Suze. I can just I can offer, just, oops, I'm getting, sorry. Um, I can just offer that what everybody else is creating so far is four to six weeks. Um, and the advice I gave Lori um, and Lisa was to take one kind of module or one week's worth of content from your program, if that's what you have, and expand on that. And it can be in any format that you want. It could be video format, uh, PDF format. Uh, we can email the person you know, every day if you want. It can be one email a week with links in it. It's really up to you. Um, and if you wanna have a strategy call about what to offer, uh, I'm happy to do that for you. Um, and then all the branding, you know, your branding will be on everything. And I encourage everybody at the end of what you offer um, to put your contact information and offer for a free consultation with you, whether it's 15 minutes or 30 minutes, whatever you feel comfortable with. Um, I hope that helps. Awesome. Yeah. Thanks, Suze. And I have my... Ah! Isn't it cute? This it sweatshirt? is cute. I haven't seen that one. Yes. And it's already dirty. Thank you. <laughs> it's white. I know. What was I expecting? 10 minutes <laughs> after I put it on. I knew I felt kindred with you. <laughs> so, so the peach, um, it's a, it's a, a clothesline, <laughs> clothesline, I always think of that, um, um, that, um, that we've been um, connected with. And what we love about the clothes, one, the clothes are really comfy. But the other thing is the company itself, um, their, oh, is oh, there we go. The swing jacket. The swing jacket, yeah, sorry. I have my, well, I don't have my pants on, but you can't see my pants. <laughs> um, but what's nice about this company is it really is a company of women, you know, clothes made for women by women. And they really do practice a whole uh, positive psychology. And of course, that's something that, you know, as living healthy list and um, healthy living practitioners, this is something that touches our hearts. And um, I say it is a company of women for women with women, um, but there's a really cool dude named Gunner who answers emails. 
Um, and so with Living Healthy List, you know, how Living Healthy List will make money at some point. Um, number one, we will be doing advertising and I'm end of Q2 this year, I'm going to start looking into that. I do have a dear, dear friend who could sell ice to an Eskimo. And I'm hoping that she will do some uh, marketing, some sales for me. You know, even if it's 10 hours a month, it would be really helpful. So that's one thing. That'll probably be the, the biggest um, revenue maker will be advertising on Living Healthy List. And by advertising, you know, we're looking for, you know, companies that make sense. So for example, Leah Ryan is with Volara. Her company works with NASA. They do air purification, they do water purification, um, pH balanced water, um, I'm missing something. Laundry Pure, I mean, and it's hysterical because I have had this stuff in my house for years before I ever met Leah. So what I'm looking for, you know, we'd be looking for advertising from Valara. You know, a big, you know, a company who understands, you know, the health and wellness and why it makes sense to be on a Living Healthy List. Um, so that's one way. A second thing, uh, our second revenue uh, stream will be the um, featured article on Living Healthy List. Well, actually, um, down the road, will be a paid will be paid uh, for. So just like a magazine, uh, we have a local magazine here in town called uh, Rochester Women Magazine. And to be in the magazine, it costs something. Um, so what I'm looking to do is to have that featured article. That, um, that somebody pays for that. And that would be, I would consider that person like, a, like a, for that month or that series, a, a guest blogger or a guest uh, expert type of person. Uh, so that would be the second. And then the third really is affiliate links. Um, we want to make sure that as Living Healthy List, we're giving people great resources. Um, one of my links that I don't have on there yet is called, uh, is a company called Vital Choice. They are, I've been ordering my halibut and salmon from Vital Choice for a couple of years now. And I love it because I know it's caught where it's caught. I know about the company. Um, the person who connected me with this company five years ago is Dr. Sears, uh, who is a pediatrician, very famous, like 50 books out that he's written. So this was a company that came from somebody I trust. And so we want to put them on our affiliate links. And then the others are Scout and Cellar wine, clean crafted wine. Of course, it makes sense. If we're going to be eating clean and living a healthy lifestyle, we should know what's in our wine. And then uh, Peach Clothing. Again, because we love um, the idea that it's a company of women for women. Um, and the clothes really are nice. <laughs> um, so that's actually, you know, how Living Healthy List will make, you know, we'll, we'll, that will, those will be our, our revenue streams. Um, Questions about that? Okay. Uh, so now I want to talk about what's going on in April. Between now and between, between now and April, I may be a little crazy. Um, just wrap. <laughs> Luann's like just now, Denise. <laughs> so in since January, um, a lot of you know this. Um, I've been doing interviews with some of our experts on something called a an interview series or an online summit. The summit is called Diet Demystified, How to Nourish Your Body, Mind, and Soul for a Vibrant You at Every Age. Now, initially, I was thinking diets, plural, and then we would kind of dive into the different diets and, and you know, talk to different um, kind of uh, food and, and, and health practitioners in, in those areas. Uh, but Lori made a really good point a couple of months ago, and she's like, you know, Denise, when it comes to nourishing your body, there's more to it than, than what you're eating. Um, and I took that to heart and changed the name of the way, uh, changed the name from diets to diet, which changes it to mean, you know, the, the diet that you live or the diet that you follow. Um, and that of course would include, of course, what you're eating, what you're drinking, um, what you're nourished, how are you nourishing your mind? How are you enjoying, um, the outside? Are you exercising? So we cover Oof, we cover a whole bunch of topics. We seem to cover sugar a lot <laughs> with some of our nutritionists and uh, food experts. We, it, it always kind of comes around to sugar. Um, but we talk about the environmental uh, issues, chemicals that are in our, in our foods or, or just in our environment. Um, I live on top of a hill. 
um, there used to be a, um, a corn crop that was below us. And the, one of our neighbors had the most amazing green grass like you would ever believe. But I also saw him at all, like every other day in the summer, spraying it and going crazy. So you know that had to go down the hill into that, um, that corn crop. Um, so those are the things that we, you know, we, we also talk about that in Diet Demystified. Um, I'm hoping to have uh, one of these series like every six months. Um, and most of the time, you know, we will have our experts on Living Healthy List and we'll have guest experts. Um, this particular one, I, all of my guests are Living Healthy List experts, except for one, um, the, uh, Lisa Gregg, who is my contact with Scout and Cellar Wine. Um, so I'm really excited. The interviews are 30 minutes. Um, I think I have one that's almost 40 minutes, but I tried to keep them at 30 minutes. And of course, people can watch them, um, watch them or you can listen to them, just the audio. Um, and so where you guys come in is, this is where I need your help. I'm relying on your help to get the information out there, market the program, you know, like you guys do now, you know, you share the, the links, um, you know, on, on Facebook and, and uh, that you talk about it with your audience. This is something that I need you to ramp up for me. Um, but we're gonna make it easy for you to do that. <laughs> <laughs> my assistant um, who is I have an assistant who is specifically working on the um, the summit her name is Karen Dela Cruz um, she actually was really sick for a couple of weeks so I know she was a bit MIA so um, I had one or two people who had who had said you know I, I emailed Karen but I didn't hear back from her she was um, under the weather um, really bad for a while um, but she's back on track and in the beginning of April if not the end of this month by the first of April she will be sending you um, the marketing information. So the letter to send to your email list, the, 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 ter the terms or the words to put on, um, on, on uh, social media, including the, the logo. Um, the logo is actually kind of cool. It's always weird. You know, when I think living healthy list, I think living healthy list is a group. Um, for this, for most of these summits, you know, people need to see who Living Healthy List is. And to me, we are all Living Healthy List. But you'll notice on the, the logo, it's actually my face. Because I'm doing the interviews, so I guess it makes sense to have a face to Living Healthy List. And I guess that's me. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I don't mind. Um, so I'm really excited about this. The interviews are really fun. Um, I think I do them a little differently. Uh, one, I ask people to give me the questions first um, because you guys are the, the experts in your field. And I think an interview goes much smooth, more smoothly if both people know what the questions are. I may not know what the answers are, but at least I know what the questions are. Uh, so they're meant to be fun and, and interesting, obviously. Um, ba -bum, ba -bum. So the, the series, oh, this is important. The series will actually run April 20th to the 29th. So there'll be two interviews a day. They'll be available for 48 hours after, you know, after it comes out, it'll be available for 48 hours. Um, this actually will be something that um, Living Healthy List is uh, selling for, um, for some revenue. We'll see if it, you know, we'll see what happens. You know, a lot of people sell their uh, interview series. I've never done that before, so this will be a first time for us to do that. Uh, and I think any revenue that Living Healthy List um, can bring in is really awesome because it shows that people really are interested in what we're doing, and it gives us that that push to move to that next level. Uh, da, 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 da. I do believe that each person, when you get the email from uh, Karen, you'll have your there'll be a link in there, and that link will be will be unique to you. This way we know where traffic is coming from. So for example, um, I had gotten an email from a friend of mine, um, actually Sherry Clark, who's on, on here. He's, she's one of our experts. Um, she had sent an email about a program that my friend Dallas Travers was doing. And I knew I was gonna help Dallas to, to uh, market this program of hers. Well, somehow I was reading the letter from Sherry. I clicked her link and I started using her link. And so anybody who responded from my email list actually went to Sherry's link. So um, 
nobody knew that my people were joining. Uh, and so when we when we looked back, um, I knew who my uh, who the people were that signed up under me, but um, it wasn't clear. So just to just to know that each link is unique. Denise, I have a quick question. Sure. So I'm not on the interview series. Will you be sending out links and promotion materials to everyone? I will. I will. Okay. Since, since it's living healthy list. Um, and I do believe, you know, each, each series will have, will be a little different and we'll, we'll, we'll connect with each of our experts. So, uh, yeah, it would be helpful for everyone to participate. Oh, for sure. I just wanted to make sure I was, anyone not on the, the interview series was included so we can promote and yes, appreciate get that. that out there. Yeah. Awesome. Thank you. Um, mm -hmm. Yes, Ms. Lori. I have a question that, you know, um, about creating more work. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well. um, but I was wondering, is there any way to repurpose bites from the Wonder Series and from the upcoming seminar or uh, summit? Mm -hmm to have a voice during this, that Living Healthy List has a voice during this crisis. And it also promotes um, the summit coming up. Yeah, so that's actually, that's a great question. Uh, and, and thank you for that. So I, what I'm, what, well, what I really need to do is um, once we do a, the Wonder Series, I put it on a blog, and I send it out on a blog post. So what I need to do is actually go back in and get snippets of that. Um, for the series, I'm actually gonna do that. I will do that. I'll get snippets of each um, interview and be able to post it. And so what's a, what's a good way to, what would be the best way for me to get that information to you? What I was thinking is literally it go on the Living Healthy Facebook page. Mm -hmm. It go on the, so that um, it's sort of like we at Living Healthy are concerned about, you know, and so here are some ways to spend your time. I mean, Tracy's doing a great thing about um, movement and stuff online. But I mean, just bites of already yeah. existing stuff that could be repurposed that says we, you know, we're thinking about you. Mm -hmm here, and I don't know, it could, it could be existing videos that people have already sent in um, to yeah. the site, but just get it all up on Facebook in the group just to, to a place to go to whatever. I love it. Thank you. I love that, Lori. Thanks. Yeah. Michelle, I know you had your hand up. You are going to ask something. Yeah, just Lori's question reminded me as far as the um, healthy living list, living healthy list expert interview series, um, our, not the series, but the dream, I wonder series, sorry, <laughs> so much going on in my head. No. I know. <laughs> uh, are we re, are, are we recording those and sharing them for people to go back and listen to? I've had actually people from my community ask for the replay after I promoted them, but they couldn't make it to the live. Oh, so it'll, um, on the Facebook page, um, let me think, does the Facebook page go to the blog or the blog of the Facebook page? So you're saying on Living Healthy List website, there's a blog that I can find the post to, to share the recording? Well, yeah, that's so on the, if you go on Living Healthy List, okay, so here, okay, I'm going to quiz you guys. Where's the blog? I've been on the website. <laughs> <laughs> but I couldn't find it. <laughs> well, actually, so one of the things that we're working on is I do have somebody working SEO right now. Um, Cause that one of the challenges is it, not everything is pulling when we go into the contact button and, you know, or not contact into the search button. So it's not all, it's not all popping up and it's just a matter of getting the right SEO words. Um, uh, so actually let, what I'll do is make sure that I have, have them so what the, the intent was to put it up on a blog and then what happens with our blog then there's a program that we have called missing letter that will talk about it for the next 12 months on social media so it's usually just excerpts 
but I, so one, there's the blog and then I can put it up on Facebook as well. Okay. Just okay. wherever I can access the recording to share and re for people to listen to the replay. Let me, let me go but, back after, after we get off our call, I'll double check. Be okay. and, and this is, this is, and, and Debbie, if you're, if you're, you're still listening, oh, she's still here. Everybody keeps moving around for some reason uh, on my screen. Um, this is one of the things that I definitely need help with. Um, once, you know, cause you know, I kind of get off the, the, the zoom call, I have to wait for zoom and that to finish processing. And then that's all of a sudden I need to, you know, make sure that we're putting it up on as the blog post and in uh, Facebook. Um, Thank you. Yeah, I have a question, Denise, are all those, um, posted like when you do a wonder series do you post it on the living healthy list uh facebook page the fact that we're having it yeah or yeah. or the recording well that's that's the thing it's supposed to, it's i'm supposed to do that oh okay and, but right and, now it's not there well i don't then the last one i know the last one isn't okay because uh, i just i you know we were kind of between like finishing up with um Stacy, she was finishing up some things for me. Mm. And Debbie and I just sat together on Monday. Okay. Because that would be an easy place for us all to go and just share from, from yeah. there. Yeah. Yeah. And I, I do believe, Michelle, that our, the one that we did together is there because I shared it at some point. I found it and shared it. It wasn't coming up originally, but then it did on the, I think, on the Facebook page. And from I, I the living... It. Healthy list. So we have, we have so two there's a living, living healthy, healthy list Facebook, Facebook page. page. So like that's the business page. And then we have our experts page. So which one was it, Lauren, the, that you found? I think it was on the regular living it's healthy regular list one. page. So that, yeah, you know, be on the, the people page. could go the see it. Page. Okay. Thank I'm you. pretty sure that, <laughs> I'm pretty sure. I know I got it from somewhere and I'm pretty sure that's where it was from. Yeah, and I'll have cool. to check to make sure that they're up there. But can I just jump back to what Lori said before? I think it's a great idea. And Denise, what I think if you if there are snippets that can be identified in terms of stress reduction or you know uh, controlling you know making good choices or whatever it is because we're home a lot. Oh my God, my mother sent me this funny but probably true uh, little thing today it showed somebody in like a little negligee reaching into a cupboard on one split screen and on the other it was the same person but you know she had gained enormous weight and it said it's going to be a tough few weeks you know i think it's a little politically incorrect so i won't repost it but i really kind of wanna <laughs> but, um, yeah, but well, you know, we get incorrect has gotten too much. We gotta be, we gotta <laughs> chill, people. I know. Well, you, you might find it on my IG. You never know. If I get a little stir crazy, that's the kind of thing I might do. But I'll keep an eye out for that. Um, <laughs> but I think if you listed the snippets Lori was talking about, and you listed a topic like for stress reduction for something, and then we could go and share those snippets on our pages mm -hmm. with a little blurb that we say, but it would certainly say for living healthy list, yep. the way that you post the blurb, that yep. would be super helpful. Okay. Yeah. I love it. That's a project for Debbie. That's a project to go wow. back through and find snippets. Yeah. Well, we'll, we'll, we'll figure out what we can do. I mean, and some of it, um, you know, I have some, you know, there are some Facebook lives that would make sense too. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Okay. That'd be great. Awesome. Cool. Um, that's what I have for you today. Um, try to keep this in, into the hour. Um, if anybody has any other questions, concerns, I'm here all day. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thanks, Denise. Have a great day, everyone. Have a great day. Thanks, Michelle. Thanks for your suggestions, Lori. I really appreciate it. Oh, you're welcome. I'm wishing you good results coming up. Thanks. Keep us yeah. posted. I will. I will. I appreciate it. Everybody stay healthy. Stay away stay from me. well. Yes. <laughs> Hugs. Bye. Exactly. Bye. Bye. Bye.